Right now I'm with uh, the mayor of Sacramento, which is the capital of California, and he is Mayor Daryl Steinberg. Thank you for joining us, Mayor. My pleasure, Kelly. It, uh, it's an honor to have you on NTD News, and uh, you're here for what reason? Well, I'm here to enthusiastically support my friend, uh, the next president of the United States, Kamala Harris. Um, I, I'm here because I believe... Um, that this country deserves a lot better than uh, what Donald Trump has to offer. And I know Kamala Harris and known her for uh, 25 years and uh, have seen her leadership, her uh, intelligence, her drive, um, her affability, her ability to relate. And um, she's going to be superb. You've known her for 25 years. Uh, so you've known her when she even a little bit before she stepped into public office. She is always I been knew a her when uh, she represented San Francisco. Yeah, uh, as in the Bay Area. In the Bay Area, exactly right, as its district attorney. How would you describe Kamala Harris for those who are still trying to find out who she is? She is a unique combination of compassion, drive, intelligence, and toughness. I will tell you a real story. Sure. Uh, back when I was pro tem of the Senate and she was the attorney general of California, she was one of the attorney generals that was suing the mortgage companies uh, when so many thousands of people lost their homes as a result of the, the fraud and the mortgage crisis. Well, there was a settlement presented, and most of the other attorney generals signed off on it, and Attorney General Harris said no. It's not nearly enough for the people who have been wronged by these companies and lost their homes. And she insisted that it be renegotiated to provide more relief and more benefit for the people, not only of California, but for the rest of the country. And it was renegotiated and it became a much more robust settlement. That's her. She um, is very results oriented and it's always about people, especially people who uh, who need the voice of someone to speak up for them when they've been disadvantaged or having a hard time. Mayor, thank you for sharing that. What do you think her efforts will be on a foreign uh, policy? I think she is going to um, be very smart. I think she's going to continue a lot of the Biden administration policies, but maybe with her own voice. Um, I think that she is going to demand of other countries that they... Um, act in ways that are consistent with American values. Um, I think she will be strategic. Um, she will be tough. I think she'll stand up very strong for the United States of America. I'm going to get ready to toss it back to the studio, but real quickly, last night the second gentleman, Doug Emhoff, said that she will be strong in terms of standing up against anti-Semitism. Well, I'm a Jewish American mayor, a proud Jewish American mayor, and though that message was so reassuring and so strong because anti-Semitism is rising in the country and in the world. And to hear it from Doug Emhoff, but to also know that represents the position and the values of the next president of the United States should be comforting to Jewish Americans throughout the entire country. Mayor Daryl Steinberg of Sacramento, the capital of California.